Hello everyone, welcome to the world of vaccines. So in this integrated session, we'll be discussing an MCQ on vaccine, which involves aspects of pediatrics and also it involves aspects of community medicine. I'm Dr. Sandeep Sharma, your pediatric faculty, and we have Dr. Rajasi with us. Hi, I'm Dr. Rajasi, your community medicine faculty. Yes. So we'll be discussing some questions and we'll be discussing a lot of relevant points for your MCQ entrance exam. So let us begin with the question first of all. So question says, an 18-month-old unimmunized baby came to the hospital for immunization. Which all vaccines can be given to the child at this visit? So we have four options here. Option A tells you that hepatitis B, OPV and PCG can be given. Now, uh, if you have read your textbooks, if you have attended to the videos, you would know that BCG cannot be given beyond one year of age according to National Immunization Schedule. And hepatitis B, individual dose of hepatitis B is only given as a birth dose in the neonatal period. So, because it is a 18 month old child and option A contains hepatitis B and BCG, this becomes an invalid option and so A cannot be the answer here. Right? Let us move towards option number B and over to Dr. Rajesh. Okay, so shall we go through option B? It says IPV, rotavirus vaccine and PCV. So, let's start with the first one, IPV. By the way, what is IPV? It is inactivated polio vaccine, right? Now, what is the dose? It's given as 0.1 ml, intradermal, right? These are very important MCQs, okay? And where do you give it actually? It's given on right upper arm, right? And what is the schedule? Schedule is, it's given on 6th and 14th week along with OPV, which is given on 6, 10 and 14th week, right? Now, I have one more question, which is very important for your MCQ. It's given on right upper arm, right? Do you know any other vaccine which is coming under the National Immunization Schedule, which is also given on right upper arm? Are you thinking? I have a mnemonic which will help you to answer this. Just remember M, R, I. So, R is right upper arm. A I is obviously IPV and M is MR vaccine. Okay, so you can remember or you can correlate MRI to the vaccines which are given on the right. So that naturally come, brings you to the next question, which are the vaccines? Those two vaccines coming under National Immunization Schedule that can be given on the left arm. They are BCG and JE vaccine. These are given on the left arm upper arm. So, these are important points that you should keep in your mind. Okay. Moving on to next one, rotavirus vaccine. It is a live attenuated vaccine given orally, right? On which all weeks? On 6, 10 and 14 weeks along with pentavalent, about which sir would be talking after some time. Now, how do you give it? It's given orally. So, the question is how many doses? Five doses or five drops, I would say. Five drops. Okay. Five drops. And how do you give it? I have a picture. So, till recently, we were taking this inside a syringe and five drops were installed, as you can see in this picture, inside the right cheek of the baby. Now, what does the change now? Not much of a change, but... Now, we have pre-packed small packets of rotavirus vaccine available as you can see in this picture. You just flip it open like this and then e you can easily squeeze these five drops inside the right cheek of the baby. Okay. Now, the last in option B was PCV. Now, what is PCV? As you all know, Recently, we have introduced PCV in the National Immunization Institute and it is pneumococcal 13 conjugate vaccine. We are giving PCV 13, okay, and not 23. Okay, it's given PCV 13 for children. Now, how do you give it? Two primary doses on 6th and 14th week, no 10. Two primary doses, just like you give IPV, it's given on 6th and 14th week, followed by a booster dose at the end of completed ninth month completed ninth month so two primary doses and one 
booster dose. That is how you give it. Now, what is the dosage? It is 0.5 ml and it is given as intramuscular. All these are points that you should keep in your mind. And it is given on the androlateral part of thigh. So, the question was whether this can be given. What do you think? You know, all these three, IPV, rotavirus and PCV, as per the national immunization schedule, can be given only up to one year of age. That is the point that I want to discuss. This cannot be given beyond one year of age. Okay, so that is also not the answer. Now, moving on to C. Sir, would you like to tell us more about option C?